All right, Rally Racing, no, Rally Challenge 2000. WordPress software. Pretty convinced I've never played this game before, so let's jump in on arcade. Level select easy, yes please. All right, so we've got the Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 5, Subaru Impreza uh, World Rally Championship Edition. Also Toyota Corolla. Nissan Almera kit car. So, how do you pronounce that? Is it say it? Say it. Skoda. Volkswagen Golf. Proton. Hyundai. All right. I'm probably just gonna go with the uh, Mitsubishi. Australia. Alright, that's just a big square, so not a lot of crazy turns to deal with. That's nice. Uh, yeah, let's do it. I should have looked at the options, to be honest, but I didn't. So I'll have to figure out, <laughs> figure out the buttons as we go. Oh dear, oh dear, hold on. I just realized this game's much louder than the last one was, so let me uh, fix that. Alright, I couldn't click back in the screen fast enough to get the start of the goddamn race, so let me redo all that again. <laughs> wow, all the way back to the freaking menu. I mean, the first menu, that's crazy. Alright. Well, I can look at the options now, at least. Will you blow a hairpin? I mean, there shouldn't be a hairpin on this first track, but if there is one, yes. Acceleration, A, and brake, okay, I don't know, understand how all of these things are, all of these things, but sure, oh, and they're in a row like this, duh, John, okay, all right, that's fine, we'll keep it simple, works for me. All right, this time I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. Go, go. All right, those are the two camera angles we have. Whoops. Hit the wall in our very first turn. Yeah, this looks like a really simple track, so I'm going to assume we're not going to have too much trouble. As I bounce off of fences. Seems real narrow. Which, I mean, fair. Excuse me. So you like are actually racing for position on this it isn't just a timing thing that's interesting well I mean, maybe that's what the arcade mode is versus the uh the like r regular rally mode maybe it is more timing based than that one this one's just like an actual race so i finished seventh of nine i don't think i really had much chance to do any better than that enter my name wow we did so good i should do that Yay. Oh, and you get a full-on replay and everything. That's cool. <laughs> Kyle Larson. No. Kyle Larson, I am not. <laughs> Alright, well, Spain now. We're currently ranked 7. Oh, so, like, are we going to start 7th in this race? Like, are we going to maintain our positioning? Is that what's going to happen? Ah, we are. So over the course of these races, we have a chance of climbing uh, enough spots to maybe not be too bad. I'm hitting every wall, so there we go. There's not an on-screen map. I have to go by what the guy says. 
and I'm not paying attention to that, to be honest, so, excuse me. Also, time out if you don't get those checkpoints fast enough. Which is interesting. Oh, he said hard right. I used the brake, I just didn't use it enough. So I did blow the hairpin. Kind of classy called that one. Hard right. Yeah. Alright, we got up to fourth. So there's that. Oh boy, they didn't remember my name, so I have to do this again, huh? At least I know I can hold the button down now. <coughs> Out of curiosity, are there like various camera angles or is it just locked behind? I'm curious. Oh, there are, there's like TV style replays. This is actually kind of, kind of cool. Shout out to the Whoever made this game again, Europress, was it? It's pretty neat. And you know, the car doesn't handle as bad as you think it might for a game this old, honestly. It's pretty good. I'm just bad, you know, and I don't know the tracks at all. You don't want to see me hit walls? Well, you are at the wrong stream. Alright, <laughs> last race of this easy cup, I guess. Single dev game? Well, no, I mean, there was... There was like seven names they showed at the start, but Europress was the one I remember seeing. <laughs> the main one I remember seeing. It's on the title screen. Alright. So we're fourth. I don't know if we're gonna win. Technically... We... Oh. I think we'd have to pass three people each time to win, and I always pass two the first time. Oh god. I'm not gonna make a checkpoint. Yeah, I yeah. am. Don't worry about it. It's like rainy and slick, and I am not prepping for these turns at all. Where's the leader? Oh, he's up there. Oh, that was the last one though. Dang it, yeah. So I think it's because I only got two passes in the first race. It was just gonna be too hard for me to make that up, I guess. I also did not do great in this one, so I... I, I might have still been able to pull it off if I hadn't hit all of the walls. What year was it? I don't remember what it said, to be honest. Well, you know what? Second ain't bad, though. It was our first ever time playing the game, so... Not too shabby. Did it crash? No, there it is. Credits! Oh man, we got the credits of the game, guys. We beat, we did it. We won. I think... I don't know. It was frozen. <laughs> uh... Did I break the game? No, it's it's okay. Kind of. So yeah, hold on. I think it says it right here. Yeah, year two thousand. It was Europress Software Limited, Imagineer Company Limited, and Ginky Company Limited. But I think Europress Software was the main developer. So there's arcade and there's championship. I just don't know how different it plays. But you know what? Since we definitely didn't win easy, let's try medium. <clears throat> let's see. Yeah, we'll go with the Impreza. Let's see what we can do with that. Just 
drop some frames again, because guess who forgot to reset his router for the second day in a row? That's me! Hopefully it didn't disrupt it too bad. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> Alright, we're starting off in Italy. So we need to try to get three, three positions gained in this one. If we can. It is going to be medium difficulty. However, the first guy's just right here, so. Is it hard right? I didn't break enough, though. Right. Yeah, that has two spots. See the next people up ahead, so. Oh no! Dang. I think I would have gotten this guy too. Dang it. Yeah, so we're probably not going to win now, either. <laughs> I used to be really good at road courses in the games, and then somewhere along the way I lost my ability again. I don't know. Yeah, that, if that hadn't happened on that one turn there, I... I would have gotten past that guy, and I think we would have stood a chance of winning, but I got completely stopped on that turn. I, I dove in way too early. I should have stayed out wider for the turn. So, anyway. Brazil! Let's do it. Give me two Infineon. Honestly, Watkins Glen has always been my best. But, uh... Why does this track seem familiar? You know what? I did play a random rally game one night, I remember. It wasn't this one, but it had a track very much like this, so it might be one of the sequels to this game. Like, maybe made by the same people. I remember this course out of all of them we've seen so far I didn't recognize but the, oh okay yeah this is not going great I'm not I'm only sixth so I'm not seeing okay there's a guy up there but yeah there's no way we're winning mainly I guess just because of the performance in that one it's it's kind of a bummer that that's the deciding factor you like you have to get three positions in the first one or you're just done because it gives the leader just too much of an advantage, which I mean, makes sense, but still. It is what it is, right? Because I'd have to pass four people in the next one and it's just not going to happen. And I hardly made, I hardly made mistakes in this one and it, 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 uh, it did not go great for me. I only got one spot, so. Or I got two spots, yeah. Wait, what? How many spots? <laughs> I don't even know. Not enough. That's the answer. Alright. France. Let's do it. So basically, yeah, if you blow it on the first one, you should just quit and start over because you're never going to win. Possibly. Oh. Especially if you hit every goddamn wall ever known to exist. Not gonna help. Just kept sliding. Just could, couldn't stop sliding. Out of 
my way, you jerk. Am I gonna not make the checkpoint? Just because of this guy, I couldn't get past him, man. Oh, they let me continue. I guess that's something. How would Larson do? It? I mean, I think with a little learning period and adjustment, I think he'd do great. Because he's just a natural racer, man. Um, he's got that Tony Stewart quality where I, I feel like anything... Anything he gets into, give him enough time to learn it, he's gonna do great. I mean, look at, oh, well, we got past him quick this time. Look at Stuart now, he's freaking winning in drag racing. You know what I mean? Like, it's, I think Larson's the same kind of, same kind of guy. You give him a little time, he'd, he'd be, he'd be really good. Yeah. We might get this guy, but. And that is debatable. No, we got him. But we're not getting the leader. So the race is basically over. I may time out even. No, we got it. So basically, yeah, every single time has been proven exactly the same. If you don't get three spots in the first race, you don't win. So I don't like that that's predictable. That tells me that the AI is pretty much on a, a freaking rail and you... If you don't do well enough in the first race, you just lose automatically, so. That's kind of a bummer. <laughs> All right, get me out of here. Let's see. I could keep going with this. But also, we could switch games, too, and I think that's what I'm going to do. This was interesting, though. Uh, it, it's, I think the AI part of it, knowing that it's almost like fixed positions for them, and then you have to do a certain level of performance to get through like that, that kind of turns me off on it. But, like, the cars handle way better than you'd think they would for a game this old.